Hey guys, welcome back to Freak Motion. Today we going to create some custom text animation inside of After Effects, without using any third party plugins. It is very important to know different kinds of text animation without taking any help of plugins or presets. So without any further ado, let's jump into the After Effects, and let's get started. Alright, let's create a composition first. Give it a name you like. Take the type tool, and type a text. Press Alt plus Ctrl plus Home to center the anchor point. Also align it to the center. Open the text layer, go to Animate, and select Enable Pre-Character 3D option. By doing this, it will help to animate every single character of the text. Now click on this Animate button again, and select Position. Change the position value slightly like this. Then open range selector 1, and change the offset value to minus 100. Now add a keyframe on it. Then go forward to 1 second, and change the offset value to 100. Output will be something like this. You can change the position value anytime. Open Advance option, and change the shape to ramp up. Then also change the Ease High value to 75%. Till now the steps are simple. Let's click on this Add button, and select Rotation. Now if you play with the rotation value, we can get different types of result every time. Let's see if we change the X rotation value. By doing this, we can get a flip text animation. To get rid of this starting point, you can use opacity keyframes. Or you can add scale property on it. Now just change the scale value to zero. Now if we play, we can see that there is no starting point visible of text. But the animation looks different. So for that type of animation you should use opacity keyframes. Let's undo scale value, and let's play with other rotation values. Similarly if we change the Y rotation value, we can see the results are different from last time. But for this one you have to change the scale value to zero, so it looks better. Like this. Let's undo those changes and try to change the Z rotation value. This one is my favorite. Just change the scale value to zero. And it's ready. You can also add tracking animation on it. I am just showing you the basics. But you can try lots of things with that. One more thing that you can add here is anchor point property. By changing its value you can get more dynamic results like this. Just play with the values, and you will find lots of different ways to animate your text. I am trying to show you some different kinds of results with different values.
So this is all for the text animation. Let's try to make it unique. Here you can add a solid layer for background. Make some duplicates of this text layer, by pressing Ctrl plus D. Change the color of the each text layer. And offset the layers by 2 frames. This is not necessary, I am just showing you some simple tricks. Try to play with the values to get different results. So this is all for today. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. Till then have fun and stay safe.